sitcoms are our jam. At the Aston family house, when we wanna bond with each other, we turn on sitcoms. Hey everybody, it's Sean Aston here, and if I know anything about anything, it's that I know everything about sitcoms. Situation comedies, I own them, I love them, bring it. And friends, were they on a break? 1,000% yes, Ross was right, Rachel was wrong, moving on. Who's my favorite friend? Nope. <laughs> Nope, nope, hold on, let me tell you. You asked me which friend I am. Which friend am I? Nope. I'm probably Joey. I'm a cross, but we're all a cross between everything. We're all, all of them. How about that? You kind of son of a gun's gonna ask you which friend you are. It's outrageous. Go ahead, more about friends, come on. I'd rather eat the uh, Joey special because it's got a lot of positive energy around it. Joey sandwich while cranberry and turkey and you know filled with the Thanksgiving something or other. It's 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 all about the fury of the professor eating it when he's yeah, it's definitely Joey special for sure. Is the office better after Michael Scott leaves? No. It's not that it's not great, it's just not better. If you say Dwight. You're just pandering to some part of yourself that doesn't deserve to be around anymore. Jim wins, mic drop, walk off home run, enough. Dwight, I'm sorry. Oh my God, Sophie's Choice. Uh, Parks and Rec. I was shipping them. I did very much. Why? Well, I mean, I'm not sure which element of the ending you're talking about, but to me, it was all about the blue um, French horn, right? Is it French horn? Yeah, the blue French horn and going back there. So, yeah, but the mother was great. Love the mother. She was perfect. Yeah. That's one for the ages. Can't answer that one. Can't answer that one. As opposed to, yeah, I mean. This is what's so lazy about your question. The first Halloween heist in Brooklyn Nine-Nine was the first. So it had that unbelievable, you can't believe they're gonna keep going there quality to it. But then when you want something so badly as for example, to have a second Halloween heist, and they've built it up and built it up. For them to go there and have it be great is even better. So they are exponentially increasing in their value and you make me sick. Uh, well, Ken Marino, who played one of the captains, right? Is a friend and I thought, his, I thought he was as the uh, chief, right? He came in as the chief. Um, I thought, uh, what's a uh, 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 Haber did one right as a chief? Yeah, I don't know. They're all they're all good. Enough, enough. I remember when I said I was an authority on sitcoms and I wanted to keep talking about it? Somehow it's like crushing my will to live. There are no choices in sitcom television. There's only more. <laughs>